Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review and today we're going to take a look at Rusty and Dusty Rusty's The Rusty's Brothers. So before I get right into the review, let me discuss something. So Rusty and Dusty were the owners of Rusty's, the sponsor of Lightning McQueen. And and their previous, and they founded Rusty's sometime in the '60s, and and their their previous their first and previous racer was a a muscle car who number and which is a name with a racer with no name, just a number zero one, and was painted green and red with a yellow number 01 on both sides and and it looked very similar to one of Richard Petty's STP cars from the early 70s and, and and some and around and early and in early 2005 the racer number 01 had an accident and and ended up being replaced by Lightning McQueen, who won, who wanted to ditch Rusty's after the once the King had retired, and he but decided to stay to Rusty's after his display of sportsmanship. And they went on to win seven Piston Cup championships. And and in 2016, when in when when a next gen when a wave of next gen racers began dominating the Piston Cup circuit, Lightning tried to keep up with the next generation, but continuously lost. And many ang and a mob of angry paparazzis began asking. In the two brothers' questions of if Lightning was going to try and keep up or if he was going to retire. So, in February of 2017, they, they sold Rusty's to Sterling, Lean, Lean, who was going to... Who, and Lightning McQueen... Bidded them a farewell, and the two of them left. And during the ending credits of Cars Three, a photograph of them seen on a beach after their retirement was shown. And the two of them were voiced by Tom and Ray Magliozzi, the Car Talk guys. Although, although three years after, and. And Tom Magliozzi's death achieved recording earnings were can be heard in Cars 3 although and so now let's get right into the review here so first we're going to take a look at Rusty Rusty's here we've got his friendly facial expression and his grill and his headlights and and on and on the left side we've got he has a his blue paintwork is all shabby we've got his side view mirrors and and on the top we've got his black and yellow top and and we've got the word dart which he is a 1963 dodge dart and on the and on the back we've got his license plate saying rust our fair city which is half of the word Rusty's and on the right side same design and now for his brother Dusty Rusty's here we've got his f weird funny expression and his black grill and over top we've got his the, the Dodge logo which he is a 1964 Dodge A100 passenger van and on the Left side, we've got his 
chrome silver white rims on his black wall tires and a bit of shabby blue paint and a gray striping I mean on his enamel and back and on the back we've got his license plate saying Ease Our Fair City which is also the rest of the word Rusty's and on the right side same design but complete but in reverse we also got his side view mirrors and that is it so now let's compare the two of them with other Dodge vehicles we've got Mini who is a 1996 Dodge Caravan and some of the some of the Challengers we've got Snot Rod who is a 1970 Dodge Challenger Rod Torque Redline who is a third gen and Dodge Challenger possibly most likely a two, between 2008 and 2010 and Steiner who is a 2008 Dodge Challenger and now let's pull up some of the the rest of the Team Rusty's members. We've got Mac, Lady McQueen, and lastly, my name is not Chuck, and that is it. So what do you guys think? Which Dodge vehicle is your favorite, and which Team Rusty's member is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you thumbs up and subscribe. And also, don't forget to leave any suggestions in the comments down below. Oh, I would really appreciate it very, very much. And, and it would also be really extremely helpful to me while building up my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review. So, goodbye now.